Okay, good morning. Welcome to... Math practice number 66. Math practice number 66. Okay, so today we're going to do kind of a similar problem to what we did for math practice 65. So a rectangle has side lengths of 2 and 6. A square has the same perimeter as the rectangle. Which has a larger area? Which one has a larger area? The square or the rectangle? Okay? Interesting. Yeah, this is a pretty interesting problem. All right, how do you want to approach it? Let's draw a picture like we did last time. Okay. So this would be 2 and this would be 6. Okay, very good. Now, a square has the same perimeter as a rectangle. So this would... Now, we draw a square here. It has to have the same perimeter as the rectangle. Yeah, it has to have the same <coughs> perimeter. Well, the perimeter, well, the perimeter of the rectangle is just two plus six plus two plus six, and two plus six is eight, so eight plus eight is sixteen. Okay. So, so the perimeter of the rectangle is sixteen. So, but f and. 4 plus 4 is 8, so the perimeter of the, the, side, the side length of one of these has to be 4. Okay. Now, which has a larger area? Yeah, which has a larger area? So, for this one we need to draw four, square, four squares on the side. So, here's the now four squares on this side too. So this area is sixteen. Okay. Very good. Now we have to have six squares on this side. Two, three, four, and five. And now we have to have two squares on this side. So this is now the area of this is twelve. So this one has a larger area. Okay, hey, that, that's a really great job. Okay. Okay. So we started out, and we because it was a geometry problem, we made sure we drew a picture, right? So we drew a picture of our rectangle with, with sides of 6 and 2. Mm -hmm. And then we said, hey, that means the perimeter is 16. Now we have to draw a square whose perimeter is 16. And that means each one of the sides has to be 4. It's 4 plus 4 plus 4 plus 4 is 16. Mm -hmm. And now we need to find which one has a larger area. So we have to find the area of both of them. Now the area of a square is this side times this side, 4 times 4, which is 16. And the way you can see that is there's 4 squares each way, right? There's 4 rows of 4, so 4 times 4 is? 16. Good job. And the area of this one is 2 times 6, because there's 2 rows of 6 squares, or 12. So the one that has the larger area is the? Square! Good job. Great job today, honey. That was awesome.